Hey, what's up, everybody? We're playing some more Pokemon. We're here in the lab. Still looking for that key. Oh, 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 you're that kid from the Frost Cavern on your lungs? Some this time. Yeah. Oh, that's cold. Cold is in that cavern. Your Pokemon don't even count for anything. We gathered data about all trainers in the region through the Hollow Caster, so we know all about you guys. And you know how the Mega Ring is used to awaken up Pokemon's power, right? Just like how the ultimate weapon can max out a Pokemon's power. Looks like you and me are practically after the same thing, yeah? I don't know, man. I'm just playing Pokemon, man. I just want to get some shinies. I don't want to do all of this. This game is just has good shiny rates. Right. Anyway, let's go ahead and surf on it. It's all in a bit. Surf the pond. Go. We go. Alright. Pretty cool. Although I don't think I have anything. Is Dazzling Gleam effective against Weevil? F or Gore, but we're gonna. It is! Alright, wonderful. Good to know. So... I think it's just because it's nice. I forgot. Is very good against the ice or dark? I'm pretty sure it's because of the ice. Oh, you're so strong. You and your Pokemon are most certainly not ordinary. I thanks, I guess. I mean, I just... Yeah. The victor goes to spoils here. An elevator key for you. Thank you very much. The power of the legendary Pokemon, the power to grant life to all around us, it is a mysterious ability that even scientists like us haven't been able to decode. What do you think will happen to the world if we fuel the ultimate weapon with something like that? I don't know, probably nothing. Thank you. I'm gonna go now. Alright, so now I go zoop. Mm. This took us nowhere, correct? Oh yeah, this took us to the Okay, I can just go to the elevator now, right? Okay. David, which is me, use the elevator key. B2? Alright. Why do I have an elevator for there's only two places you can go? Just use the stairs. My man. Listen, one who will face Whoa, that man is tall. Holy! What are you doing in there, bud? Now, why are you so tall? Let me get some of those jeans, bro. A terribly long time ago. There was a man in a Pokemon he loved. He loved that Pokemon very much. A war began. The man's beloved Pokemon took part in the war. Several years passed. He was given a tiny box. The man wanted to bring the Pokemon back, no matter what it took. The man built a machine to give it life. He brought his beloved Pokemon back. The man had suffered too much. His rage still had not subsided. He could not forgive the world that had hurt the Pokemon he loved. He turned the machine into the ultimate weapon. The man became a bringer of destruction and ended the war.
the Pokemon that was given life must have known. That the lives of many Pokemon were taken to restore its life. The, resu the resurrected Pokemon left the man. Get the key back. It should not be used. Everything will vanish again. Do you want to know unending pain like I have? That is AZ. He has the same name as a king that lived 3,000 years ago, and for some unknown reason, he had the key to the ultimate weapon hung around his neck. It's finally time. Follow me to my chambers. Alright. Can I talk to the big lad, though? Get the key back. It should not be used. Everything will vanish again. Okay. Alright. Where's your chambers, bud? Another floor? B3. Alright. Next level we go. Um, okay, there's nothing now except the vent. Oh, it's... Okay. So the Pokeballs were received, and the Pokemon we gathered are where they need to be. Add it all up, and it means all preparations are complete. The only thing left to do is put the plan in motion. Counting on you. One push of a button, and we can activate the ultimate weapon from this room. I believe being a chosen one means you have the potential to change the future. Whether we activate the ultimate weapon or leave it safely underground will rest upon if you actually have this potential or not. Ho ho ho. You're the one I've heard so much about. I've been waiting for you. I need to do a little research on you. Come on. Let us go. Alright, bud. Zero sick. Oh my god. Really? That's like what you got for me. It's a crowbat. Man, this is better than a gold bat that all your other people had. Alright, well, I'm gonna take it out of the sky. Easy peasy. I guess I'm also a little cooler now. Only channel 34. Big Jitter 34. Nah, you don't need to try it back. I'm not gonna use you in battle anyway. Lamb Pent to 42. Malamar. Okay. That is a pretty cool Pokemon. I actually really like Malamar. Can we Dazzling Gleam it? I don't think that's effective. It is a very effective. Okay, so apparently, Fairy is, get it, is good against Dark Pokemon. So that's pretty cool. Oh, oh, you're wonderful. Your Pokemon are amazing. Well, you've only seen one of them, but thanks, bud. I appreciate it. Wonderful, amazing. You have tremendous skill and bravery. When you add that up, it means I will be telling you something very interesting. It happened 3,000 years ago. The ultimate weapon was used to put an end to the war in an instant. If we use that incredible power, we can finally free Kalos of the foolish humans that plague it. Behind me, you'll find a red button and a blue button. One of them is the button for activating the ultimate weapon. Push one now. Come on. See, I feel like this is a trick, right? I feel like... The red button is for Team Flare. The blue button is not the Team Flare. But I feel like that would be way too smart. So I'm just going to go ahead and click the blue button. Yeah. You pressed the, oh, you pressed the blue switch. Winner, winner. Congratulations. I'm still going to activate the ultimate weapon. <laughs> the boss promised that we win if you push the correct button. But I refuse to let the potential go to waste. I'll just use my remote. Here, click, click. And the power is on. Come on, look. Look at the monitor. What a wiener, dude. I clicked the right button. Why? No, oh, that's not good. Bro, what about all these houses, dude? A little, a little lag in the game. Bro, 
Oh, those houses, no! This is literally sideways. Oh no. You had to destroy like an entire village to do it, but pretty cool. Did you see the ultimate weapon is reborn? Poisonous flower has bloomed. All shall perish except for Team Flair. Look at Geosenge. It has bloomed into Geosenge Town. The boss's dream of creating a beautiful world will come true. Add it all up, and it equals a victory for our science. Well, sounds like you guys just suck. Well, now I'm guessing I can go down to Route 18. Is that, like, what this is, like, basically trying to tell me, right? That I can kind of just go down to Route 18? Could be one. soon that I might need a lot of balls for and I have 148 so let's just grab 41 ultra balls I think that should be more than enough if I need more than that then I could probably just give up uh, we already have enough magic balls okay cool thank you Mr. Storman it is time to fly over over I said over twice let's go over over to um just move fly Geosenge. Where is Geosenge? Quamarine, Shalor. Yes. Corner of the map here. Skirt. Pick me up. We going. We flying. We'll be back. Thank you, Fletchender. Appreciate you. Everything you do. Okay. Wait. What happened? Oh, okay. Well, let's check this first. Uh, where was the entrance to our city? Oh, was it in the boulder? No, it was to the top left, but... I just want to see if there's anything else out here that I can do. I don't think there's anything actually I can actually do. Alright, well, there's the focus stop, but I'm not, not like I'm going to need it. Poor guy in there is probably freaking out. Well, that's a big old little weapon you got there, huh, bud? Let's also give it a quick save. I didn't think about that, too. Okay. Blink. You better have come prepared, both you and your Pokemon. So, actually, I've come, I've come with a couple of new Pokemon that I need to evolve. So, that works. All right, main trick. That's the worst thing gonna have. Hi, main trick. Look, I'm also gonna surf on it though. This will be pretty lit. have a snack. I'm kind of hungry. Alright, scrap team. No, we can keep the whole one in. Yeah, I'm kind of hungry. Not gonna lie. I don't care of a snack after this episode. Alright, let's go ahead and surf it again. Because what else are we going to do? Let's just be starving death. Starving to level 17. Here we go. Nineteen. I'm guessing Fletcher is gonna start going really quickly here. Roll that. Forty-five. Roll that. Let's go ahead and give it a, give it a quick little thunder bolt here. The zoink. Alright, Gibble to level twenty-seven. Dragon Claw. Might be a cool little move. Let's go and get rid of. Let's get rid of Sand to him. I don't need Sand to him. It's a weird move. 
I benched to 28. Let's change it to 20. Behold the moment of my defeat. Don't even think, don't even think about blinking. Oops. Hey yo. Gibble is evolving already. Okay, well that was very, very quick. Um, but luckily we still need to get it to Gar Garchomp. Really. And Garchomp is... I mean, I know it's like... It's a very popular favorite because it is technically... I think it's a pseudo-legendary, but... um, I've, I've, Garchomp has really grown on to me because of Pokemon Go. But, um, yeah. Because Gibble Tournament Bite, because I've been using Garchomp in basically every raid in battle in Pokemon Go, so it's, um... Yeah, Lissandre does whatever he can to help us realize our goals. Surely he deserves respect for that. Nah, depends what your goals are there, bud. If my goal is to hit my head on every single uh, lamp post I find, and if I try really hard, does that really make me respectable? David, I'm coming. When I was in Lissandre's lab, the masked heroes told me what is going on. They also told me Team Flare plans to do with Ultimate Weapon. Come on, let's stop Team Flare. The world isn't corrupt enough to give up on it yet. I agree. Let's go. I think the world sucks, but I don't want to just kill everyone because that's not very cash. All right. So, how many floors down? Was that like 13 floors? Cool. Also, where did Serena go? She kind of just like dipped. Hey. It was uh, many Pokemon lost their lives. Okay, thanks for the genius information. Attached to the stones on Route 10 are an energy source. Okay, I've already been told that. I'll leave my fate. Okay, yeah. okay. We're absorbing the energy from a serious tree, but that's it. There isn't a Pokemon anywhere near here. All systems are go. What about you? Everyone in the world must. Okay, yeah. So there isn't enough happiness. That's just dumb. I mean, there's not enough happiness to go around. Happiness isn't a chemical, or isn't like a quantifiable. I guess if you count each serotonin, I don't know, man. The ultimate weapon's flower has finally bloomed above the soil. Don't you find its beauty captivating? As we speak, it draws the energy from the legendary Pokemon. David, I apologize that the weapon was unearthed even after you chose correctly in the lab, but conflicting egos drive this world. Things don't always go the way you want. We're not going to let you use the ultimate weapon. Even though resources, space, and energy on this planet are limited, the number of people in Pokemon has increased to an unsustainable level. Whether it's money or energy, the ones who steal are the ones who win in this world. That doesn't give you the right to destroy everyone, but but the ones Team Flare chooses. So tell me, the Mega Ring, did you share it? That's different. We competed for it, but when there's only one of something, it can't be shared. When something can't be shared, it will be fought over. And when something's fought over, some must survive without it. The only way to create a world where people live in beauty, a world without conflict or theft, is to reduce the number of living things. What about Pokemon? Tears, why? Pokemon shall no longer exist. What? Pokemon are wonderful beings. Humans have worked with Pokemon We've helped each other flourish, but precisely because of that, they will inevitably become tools for war and theft. Enough of this. You want to stop the ultimate weapon, and I refuse to do so, so I will keep you busy for just a moment. Alright, bud. You are challenged by Team Flare Lissandre. He's got four more Pokemon. Are they the same? Oh, he, he evolved his Iron Food. Okay. So now we get to fight its actual evolved form. Pretty cool. I'm still gonna kill it, but very cool. I'm glad he's investing in these Pokemon. Actually evolving them. Okay. Shinder, 21. High War. Okay, so it'll be the same Pokemon. Go ahead and just use another Surphonic Thunder type. Like, we literally defeated you like five minutes ago. What's your deal, dude? Why do you gotta make, why do you gotta make me beat you again? So we just fought. And Ponyard to 37. Champions to 29. Um, no, you don't need me. Actually, I kinda do want Dig. Yeah, let me get, let me get rid of, uh, Bye. I don't need Bye here. 
If she did, it'd be pretty cool to have. Which under the 22. Launch Pro, okay. He evolved his Murkrow also. I'm gonna hit it with a Dazzling Gleam. I could also hit it with a Thunder. Either one works, to be honest. Last one, Gyarados. Very, very cool. He had the Gyarados last time. Oh, now, is he gonna Mega Evolve? And now that would be something else. Are you gonna Mega Evolve the Gyarados? Oh, he's a Pope. Where's your Mega Ring and Mega Stones, bruh? Missing out. Even though I don't use them. Drew me to 37. The strength to protect, huh? Well, what are you really protecting? A tomorrow that will only end up being worse than today? David received? Hey, I don't know why I read that. Got easy 10k for it, though. You're as strong as ever, but it's too late. There's no hope for you now. Go down to the lowest floor and see for yourself. It's not over yet. Big D, let's look for the legendary Pokemon. Trainers are protected by Pokemon, but they protect Pokemon too, right? Look, you can see the entrance to the lower floor there. Right, get out of the way, old man. I'm trying to catch myself a legendary. Skirt, let's hurry. Okay, I was until you started talking to me. Dummy. I'm afraid we're going to have to, have to ask you to turn back. Legendary Pokemon is at the end of this chamber after all. Why did you tell them that? Why would you even do something like that? I, I don't know either. Why would you do something like that? Our team player admin and team... Oh, okay. There's an admin and a grunt. I'm like, yeah, of course. This is really stupid. Alright, and hey, yo, it's a double battle. I'm re I really like it when I have to double battle Serena because I can surf and just wipe out everything without actually feeling bad about it, which is really, really nice. I don't care if I kill her. Baby. And I like it that her Pokemon are the one that gets killed. everyone here. Yep. Oh, I forgot that Toxicroak absorbs it. Oops. Okay, trap into 30. Chinder to 24. Okay, Corian out. Alright, let's go ahead and hit Toxicroak with a little Thunderbolt that I'm pretty sure won't work. Oh, that's gonna hurt me too. That's not very nice too. Alright, Victoria, can you hit it? Hit it with anything? Except you suck. What did I expect? It's alright. You literally couldn't even do like a quarter of this. Come on, Serena. This is why you keep losing your battles. <laughs> you fools. You don't even have suits. You might be strong, but your teamwork is still a bit lag. Ooh. What? Because I killed her Pokemon? It was for the greater good, but although now I'm starting to sound like the sound here, which is ironic, but it's alright. Um, let's go ahead and waste the quick hyper potion here, just because I want Stormy at full health here. I just I don't want Stormy at uh, low health. I get well, Sandra is trying. Okay, you need to say it faster. Oh, another battle. Okay, even if things are just as we heard, I can't believe they're sending smart guys like us to run off. A little Radita that wandered in. We, we won't lose. We won't get. We won't get one step further. The trainers move onto the next level. Will be Team Flare. All right. Please don't have another Toxic Pro because I want to surf and I want to kill everything. Okay. These I can kill with a surf. And I'm pretty sure neither has a priority move, so this should be a pretty good fight here. Alright, that's fine. I'm just gonna run and surf it up, and we should be good to go. Here we go. Bonk. Good. Kill everything. Again, I, ironically, what I'm here to stop, but whatever, man. If it works, it works. You can't tell me otherwise. Oh, Meowstick survived. Look at that. Good job, Meowstick. Do I need metal sound? I don't think my pawnyard needs to think metal sounds. I think I'll pass on that. He's a little smarter than that. Alright, a bunch of level ups. Roost? Nah, he doesn't need roost. Yes, I lost, but no matter. Lissandre is the one who will take care of things. I may have lost, but it doesn't matter. Okay, literally said the same thing. You guys are weird. Right, let me go past you. You guys are weird. 
right, where are we at? Big D, Serena. I don't believe it. What are you doing here? I'm sorry. I I know I'm just going I'm just going to slow you down. But but friends should Oh I thought she was like a bad guy, like, I'm here to slow you down. No, she literally said, Oh, I'm go Alright. <laughs> but friends should stick together. I'm the one who should be apologizing. You came all the way out here and I wasn't very considerate of your feelings. You are right. Friends should stick together. Big D. We should all go together, right? Yeah, of course. I knew you'd agree. Okay, Shauna, Big D, and I will go on ahead. Stay close to us, okay? Alright, thank you. Stay close, okay, day. Um... I don't know. Is it, like, literally up next? Oh, we all won the battle. Our plans haven't succeeded just yet. We can't afford any careless mistakes. Who's got that flair? Team flair. Yeah, we've got that flair. Team flair. It's kind of suck, but that's alright. Yo, why can't we do triple battles or quadruple battles? Let's just get all the Pokemon out here. And I think we surf like seven Pokemon at once. I think that'd be kind of cool. Alright, another two Pokemon that I can surf. Okay. Let's bring out another. Oh, Oh, okay, he faked out, not me. Okay, good, good. I love it. Ooh, Scrappy didn't die. Why would you do something like that? Meowth is probably gonna die here, though. Crunch? Ah, oh, I don't crunch me. Why would you do something like that? I didn't do anything to you, so I tried to kill you. I don't think this is fair. Okay. Bring in a Vaporeon, but it doesn't really matter. I'm gonna zap the scrap anyway. Doesn't make much particular sense, but hey, what do you mind to say? Go me to 38. Whoa, wait, what am I doing? I don't need muddy water. Oops. I'm just clicking buttons, I shouldn't be clicking. The bite to 30. Sandre is like the sun to us. He represents our hope. That's a little weird. Probably find a better idol than Sandre, personally, but. Okay, who am I to say? Another fight? Anyway, we gotta hurry. Stop it. I'm trying. Would you shut up? Okay, I'm guessing that's where we need to go, right? It's an electric lock. What should we do? This might help. It's a device that helps you when you're stuck on a puzzle. Clement gave it to me. An electric lock and a puzzle are the same sort of thing, right? Ta-da! Lock open. That's a very odd plot device. I've got a machine to do it! Alright, man. I'm the oh, the device actually broke. Oh. Never mind. Amazing, Shauna. You and Clement devices are both full of surprises. So, finally here. Legend broke one side. Let's go help it. Alright, we're gonna do that next episode. Thanks for watching.